Thank you for buying this 100826 Candy Beam from Fixture Displays. You can search this number on fixturedisplays.com to locate this item. These are all the components. In this video, we're going to show you step-by-step -step instructions. You have the base, you have the dividers, hardware. Uh, note dividers, one of them are the say, uh, same kind, the other is another kind. Uh, then you have front and back, and top and lid. It is important to know that uh, the base, uh, as we uh, have them in stock, is directional. In other words, if you install them um, the wrong way, you're going to find your front end, uh, the locking mechanism, not lining up properly. So you want to take your time to set it up and before you're fastening. Um, just be mindful that the, the bottom panel uh, is directional. The back panel is not. So you're going to go ahead, you know, install all the dividers. And remember, when you do need a replacement part, you want to identify which divider uh, you are needing. Now, in this video, we're going to installing the front panel first, and they all line up. And this is a good way to avoid the bottom panel get installed by mistake. So now you can put on the bottom panel, and if you flip the uh, bottom panel 180 degrees, you are going to find the whole position is not ideal. But if you do it this way, uh, you shouldn't have any problem. Now we're going to install the top panel. I encourage you to browse fixturedisplays.com for other products and services. In this family of products, we have also 100827, which is stackable. And we have 100808 and 100809. Smaller independent bins, I recommend 19491, 19493, and 100871. If you have any questions after watching this video, feel free to email us cs at charliesam at fixturedisplays.com. The current versions uh, are going to have improvements in that uh, we know we are doing away with the nuts they are uh, the holes are pre-threaded so that you don't have a risk for the nuts falling off however you may get the one with nuts more than likely in the future versions we are removing the lock uh, because most of the customers use this have provided feedback they aren't really using the lock So if you just so happen you watch this video and bought a product that doesn't have a lock, it's quite normal because we keep uh, constantly change based on customer demands. And this is about 24 by 12 by 12. If you like this product and video, please consider like us, subscribe. Remember, leave a good seller feedback and a product review. If you have a custom requirement, we love the opportunity to make those for you. Thank you once again for shopping fixture displays.